Who would really love to gank the Shadow Fiend mid. Probably won't be able to. Oh my goodness, Super's oh, getting flanked. No. Oh, Fender had plenty of time to plot this one out. And, oh, bad times. All right, well, they're giving it another go. Oh my god, dude. Oh shit. Oh my god. Ah, god damn it. Why can't they wait for us to be ready? <laughs> shit. They go in. Artez gets caught out. He'll be taken down. Holy crap. Ice, ice, ice. Now on the chase out. Oh. Jenkins, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Oh, Lord have mercy. What the hell did just happen? I can't even comprehend. They just go, go <laughs> now. Fiend. They feel a lot more durable. Something was to break out, but Black's also getting in on the action, adding that bonus for mid lane. You see the double spike and stun. They trade. Artez gets blasted with the finger. Ice, ice, ice is an exchange. Echo, they're going on the dread to stop out the ward, and they get it done. Fenrir now dominating, but they are going to TP okay. out. Can they get the jump in? Uh, look, they do make the call on the low hand side, getting a hold of them. Big Gus back, and Black is able to unload huge right click damage. Axe has no chance, and now it's going to be Hellraisers on the way out. The egg's going to be dropped, so Ice Ice Ice, not going to lose his life, uses the Icarus side to catch on up to your Enchantress. Might not be able to attack quick. Go away, shop. What the? Okay, now they make the go. Got him. He's going to be able to retreat. Oh, not going to be enough. Surge is not going to be able to help out, and Goriath. Let's we'll see. Goriath's no ward. Considers moving forward with the self iron shell. Oh, they blow up the Enchantress. That's a dieback for him. And they take down the Razor. This might be a quick GG, Jenkins.